Hey folks, Nitno here. Today I want to discuss some of the mods that I would love to see implemented in Official DayZ. For a long time now, these have been some of the most requested features. Let's dive into it. But first, a quick shout out to our sponsor, G Portal Game Servers. Rent your own server today and save 10% by clicking the link in the description. The Nitno DayZ server is proudly hosted by G Portal. Join the fun and survive with us. Starting off, we have a code lock. I would love to see a digital code lock make its way into Vanilla Daisy. Currently, you put a lot of time and effort into making a base, and it's all locked behind a simple combo lock that can be cracked with relative ease. A digital code lock is a huge quality of life improvement for base builders, and would alleviate a lot of frustration that goes into it. If they want to save development time, they could even keep the existing combo lock model, and then increase the number of digits, and improve the UI to remove the spin dials. Speaking of bases, it would be great to get some of the ideas from Base Building Plus put into Vanilla Daisy. We don't need everything, but high on my list would be the ability to make roofs. Too often, the biggest complaint in Vanilla Base Building is that players can simply boost over walls and completely negate the security of making a base. I would also like to see simple door pieces and window blockading. Currently, it's a little bit overkill to block a small door with an entire gate. If I was in Daisy in real life, I'd probably find an existing structure and blockade the doors, windows, and make sure there's no holes in the roof. Giving us simple solutions to those three issues would go a long way. A simple mod that most servers run is earplugs. Turning on a car can be extremely loud in Daisy. Driving a car for an extended period of time at a loud volume is likely not good for your hearing. With the earplugs mod, you can simply press a button and your in-game volume is decreased. Press the button again and your volume returns to normal. I would love to see this put into the UI so you can bind it to a key or a button and it would go a long way to protect players hearing. Speaking of getting around town, it would be great to have a bicycle in Daisy. Having an option that is faster than running around but not quite the speed of a car, would be a great way to get players moving around the map. There is a mod called DBO Bike that currently exists for modded servers. I'd love to see the Daisy devs hammer out a working bicycle, even if it's not perfect. Last but not least, helicopters would be an awesome thing to see in Vanilla Daisy, as long as they are properly balanced, rare, and take an appropriate amount of parts to fix up. It could serve as an excellent endgame goal to get repaired and up and running. There are a few mods such as Daisy Expansion and Red Falcon who have helicopters that work great in modded Daisy, aside from the occasional bug or two. If you are going to have helicopters though, you have to have the option to make a roof for bases. One of the coolest moments in modded Daisy is when you hear a helicopter overhead and realize it's landing near you. It creates an intense scenario where the players on the ground want to either avoid the geared players in the heli, find a way to ambush and kill the players in the heli, or simply sneak into the heli and try to hijack it. Let me know what mods or other ideas you have that you'd love to see in Vanilla Daisy by commenting below. i love to hear your ideas. Blast the video on the left and take your game knowledge to the next level. Subscribe to the channel and snipe the like button. Thank you and have an awesome day. Peace.